Protein in urine can be a sign of wider health issues. In this video we explain how to test for protein in urine at home and what to do if you the result is positive. Video Summary Protein in urine is a symptom of chronic kidney disease CKD. Protein in urine can be tracked at home with a home urine test Testing for protein in urine at home is easy and inexpensive A clean urine sample must be collected for accurate results The results of a urine test must be read after the minimum reaction time has passed. Protein in urine home test Protein in urine is a symptom of chronic kidney disease CKD. Protein in urine may be the first sign of kidney damage and is useful in the early diagnosis of this condition. Patients already diagnosed with CKD can test for protein in urine at home to monitor their treatment and disease progression in addition to laboratory results. If you want to test for protein in urine at home it is easy and inexpensive. In this video we will show you how to test for protein in urine at home. We will take you through the steps to conduct this home urine test and give you some good tips for understanding your results. Urine in Protein Test Instructions Step 1 Select a urine test strip to conduct the protein in urine test at home You need to purchase a urine test strip that tests for protein. The following products include a protein assay and can be bought inexpensively in a pharmacy or online. Siemens Albustix Siemens Heuristix Roche Combur 5 Aiken Mission A10 Your local pharmacist or doctor can also recommend a urine test strip that tests for protein in urine. Step 2 Collect a urine sample to collect a urine sample you will need a disposable urine collection cup. Taking a sample from your first urination in the morning is recommended by many experts. Before collecting your sample men should make sure the penis is clean and women should ensure that the area between the labia are clean to ensure there is no contamination. To collect your sample have your urine collection cup on hand and urinate a small amount into the toilet bowl then stop. Place the collection cup in the appropriate area and pee into the cup, stopping before it overflows. You are now ready to use your urine sample to do your urine test. Step 3 Conduct the test. Have your urine sample, your urine test strip and a stopwatch or the Puri Urinalysis app ready with the template for your urine strip ready. Dip your urine strip into the urine sample at the same time as you start the timer. Ensure all the reagent pads are submerged in the urine and are submerged for as long as your manufacturer recommends, usually 1 to 2 seconds. On removing the strip wipe it on the side of the cup to remove any excess urine. Wait until the correct reaction time has passed before reading your strip. Puri will indicate this by unlocking the template so you can enter results. When the reaction time has passed follow the manufacturer's instructions and compare the color of the reagent pads on the strip to the colored grid on the manufacturer's packaging. Step 4 Record your protein in urine results. Once you have identified the test result record the results in Puri or write them on a piece of paper or type them into an Excel spreadsheet. If recording your results manually ensure you record the date and time as well as the result of your test. If you use Puri you can save two photos with your test results. We recommend taking a photo of your urine sample and of the test result. This information can be useful when test results are reviewed by your doctor. Step 5 Review your results. If you had a negative result then you can either stop testing, or if you wish, continue testing at regular intervals to be 100% sure of the result. A series of results over time is much more reliable than a single result and we recommend you repeat the tests over a number of days to confirm the negative result. If you received a positive result then for protein in urine for the first time we recommend you visit your doctor for his opinion. Your doctor can carry out laboratory tests to diagnose the underlying cause. Until your doctor's appointment we recommend you continue testing so you have more data to share with your doctor during your appointment. For patients with an already diagnosed condition please work with your medical carer to manage the underlying conditions that may cause protein in urine to appear. Please like, comment, share, subscribe and hit the notification bell to receive information anytime I post a video like this. Thank you.